Hello and welcome to the Lucian video tutorial series. In this video, we'll go over how to set up indexing, which is required if you want to be able to search your files. Now before we begin, a word about search engines. All editions of FileCenter integrate with the powerful Windows desktop search engine. This is a search engine that is included as part of Windows. It's integrated right into Windows. And it does a very, very capable job both of indexing your files and of allowing you to search for your files with some great search queries. In addition, File Center Professional also includes its own built-in search engine. Now there are some scenarios where you may need to use this search engine, which is why we provide it. For example, if you need to search network files that are housed on a computer that doesn't run Windows. But by and large, whenever possible, we strongly recommend that you use the Windows desktop search engine because it gives you more search possibilities than the built-in engine provides. In this video, we only cover how to set up Windows desktop search indexing. Now the first step in setting up indexing is to know where your files are. We can come up here to the Cabinets button on the main toolbar to see a list of each one of our cabinets. And the important thing here is the location. Remember that a cabinet is really just a folder somewhere on your machine. Well, these are the folders for each one of those cabinets, and I need to make sure that each one of these folders is added to the indexing service so that Windows can index those files. Now, if I happen to have some cabinets that are out on a network drive, I'm going to need to repeat the procedure on the computer that actually has that drive. Each computer that has a drive with files on it that are going to be indexed is in charge of indexing those files. So you're going to have to repeat this procedure for each computer that houses files that you use. Now to set up my indexing, I'm going to come up here to the Settings button in File Center. And I'm going to select the Search option over here on the left. Now if you're using File Center Professional, you'll notice this setting right here. Default Search Engine. This is the search engine you can are going to use by default. You can switch back and forth between engines, but this will be the default engine. And I'm setting it to Windows Search. Now the button we're going to use is this one right here, Windows Indexing Options. And I'm going to note that you can get to the same group of settings through the control panel. Let me just switch over there really quick. And it's right here. It's called Indexing Options. So you can get to these settings through your control panel or through File Center. Right now we're going through File Center. Let me click this button to bring up the Windows indexing settings. Okay, and there we go. I've got my indexing options dialog. Now if you look over here, you'll notice this included locations. These are folders that Windows is actively indexing. And as I look at this list, I notice right away that it's missing one of the locations where I have a lot of my data. It's on C, My Cabinets. So what I need to do now is add that location to this list. So I come down here to the Modify button. This is the button I use to add additional folders to indexing or to take some folders away from indexing. I'll click that. And that pops up a second window where I can choose locations to add to the indexing service. I happen to know that this location that I want to add is here on my C drive, and it's right here. It's the My Cabinets folder. So I put a check mark right there, click OK, and that will now be added as one of, there we go, shows up right there. That's now been added as a location that Windows is going to actively index. Now, I'm not quite done yet. There's one more setting that I need to check. I'm going to come down here to the Advanced button. And this pops up a second dialog of Advanced Options. And the place I want to look at is File Types right here. This shows all of the different types of files that Windows is actively indexing. And I'm going to want to check each one of the kinds of files that I normally use, for example, Word documents, Excel spreadsheets, and I'm going to come down and look at PDF files specifically. And I want to make sure that it's indexing not just the fact that the file exists, but actually indexing the file's contents. For example, let's locate PDF really quickly, which is right here. And if I select PDF, you'll notice right now this is set to only index the properties of the file. I want it to index the properties and the file contents. And so I'm going to select that and click OK. And that's it. Now I can go ahead and close my indexing options and close File Center settings. 
My next step is to go out to my file server if I have a network drive and do the same thing there. Go into the indexing options and make sure that any folders on that computer that have files I want to search are being indexed. And finally, if I've had to add new folders to the indexing, I'm going to have to be patient for a couple of hours because it's going to take Windows a little bit of time to go through those files and index everything that's in them. So a few hours from now I should be able to sit down and start doing some searching.